Boris Lydia, what do you think of this? This is not what I expected. He's done well, hasn't he? Meet Lydia and her husband, Boris. I brought Baz back because I need a lot of job to be done at home that Boris can't do. Hey, hey, I can, uh, I can... No, you can't. Look, no. look at my backyard. Look how bad it is. It's <laughs> work in progress. Work in progress it may be, but there's one shining star out there, Lydia's veggie patch. It's impressive, but does have a downside. Well, every morning I water about half an hour, more than half an hour, and at night more than half an hour. And when you consider it needs to be watered every single day, that's a serious chunk of time. But I think I may be able to help out. What have you got in here? We've got shallots, cucumbers and Chinese chives. Yeah. The yard is pretty well worn where we've, we've come across there, and that's just because you go into the garden shed and it looks to me like this is the only area that sort of gets any use in the yard. Is that's, that right? Yes, that's right. So I reckon our first job is to build a path along the fence leading to the veggie garden. That sounds good. It sounds good. Sounds good. Yeah. Sounds like a bit of hard work, though. OK, who are you going to do that? Well, I've got <laughs> Boris in mind. Hey, man. You could tell, <laughs> couldn't you, Boris? I'm pretty confident that you know your way around this backyard, so I'm going to get you to help Dylan install our irrigation system. You happy with that? Yes, definitely. First for the path, Boris and I need to move all the turf and organic matter to start with a nice level surface. Then we'll mark out our path border and where some new plants will go. Some simple aluminium edging will last the test of time and give us a nice clean line. For the bed, we use a, a washed river sand. And the key here is to get it perfectly level. Once the bubble's right, I just slide that across. And that tells us that that's level from that side to that side. Once I'm confident with that, I'll just start to drag back from that level. See how I keep finding the middle of the line? Yep. It's level. So now I've just got to level this section. And you just continue it to the end of the path. Lay them in place, about even from the two sides. Yes. And then this one here clicks over that. Now that gives us a really solid base. So the last step is simply... What this is going to do is create a really stable base, yes. but all the rain can still penetrate through. That's about as simple as it is, Boris. You reckon you can handle this job? I think I can handle it now. No, it looks pretty simple. Meanwhile, I've called in Dylan. I want to help you install an irrigation system that'll save you money, Water, most importantly, time. What do you think? Sounds great. While Boris keeps at it, I've called in Dylan to give Lydia a hand setting up a Holman irrigation system in her veggie patch. First, they need to cut the main feeder line, which runs from the tap to each of the garden beds. This is the end of the line, so we're going to plug it with this little plug. Just pops in there, like so, and then it just gets clamped on with this. The entire system clamps together in the same way and, when it's in place, he secures them to the bed. Then it's onto the drip feeders. This is your drip feeder line. There's little holes here. We cut them to the length of the garden bed. Most important here, they have to be 300 millimetres apart. So we'll just get our crayon, mark it on the garden bed, 300 from the end, 300 again, and 300 again. And with that instruction, Lydia has taken to this like an irrigation system to water. And for her last job, Lydia has to connect the drip feeders to the main line. Meanwhile, Boris has been working slow and steady and has finally finished his screeding. So now it's on to the simple job of laying the shore paved bases and covering them with pebbles. The only thing left for him is to get digging and drop those lily pillies in place. And with the spare drip irrigation going along Boris's path, I'd say this garden is looking picture perfect. Boris, Lydia, what do you think of this? This is not what I expected. He's done well, hasn't he? It looked great. You did a great job. I didn't know that you can do this. <laughs> Has this lifted no. his status in the family as a macho DIY guy or not? Not really, but now. <laughs> <laughs> not really. And Lydia's irrigation system is just as impressive. And this is going to save you a lot of time. A lot of time. Thank you, Baz.